Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today I have yet another candle review for you. This one is a little bit different. I actually, before I show you what it is, I bought this last year um, at HomeSense <laughs> and I bought it towards the end of the summer season. So um, I found this at HomeSense, $14.99. I started burning it, but I stopped burning it because I'm a seasonal burner and it was towards the end of summer and as you'll know, Yankee Candles burn for a long time. I am going to review for you today Yankee Candles Large Jar in the Sand and Surf collection. And again, like I said, I picked this up at Home Sense in Canada for $14.99. Um, Home Sense winners in Canada be Home Goods, uh, TJ Maxx, Marshalls in the States, that kind of thing. So before I go too far with the large jar, I have burnt it again a few times since uh, reconnecting with it, I guess, if you will, from last summer. So I did find a scent description online and Sand and Surf reads, a tropical beach breeze of sweet orange flower, lemony citrus, fresh lavender and powdery musk. I don't know where it gets lavender from. I don't quite know. My scent appeal on cold was, um, well, I liked it, obviously I picked it up, but on cold, I would say probably like a seven. I don't, I love those suntanny, coconutty. I like that kind of thing. That is up my alley, especially for summertime. The label's cute. Not a big, again, label person, but um, this quite fitting. Um, when burning, if you close, if I close my eyes and just like walked into the room, you'd think that I was just coming off the beach in a good way. Sunscreen, like a perfect balance of sunscreen and sand, like, I don't know, like the perfect copper tone or whatever sunscreen you would wear and a little bit of sand and it's not dirty or anything. And it's so hard to, unless you've been at the beach and unless you've experienced that or as a kid, some memories, that kind of thing, you'll know exactly what I'm talking about if, if you've been there and done that kind of thing. I really enjoy this. Um, I'd hesitate to pick this up in full price, but I do hope that I find it at Winners or Home Sense again for $14.99, which is what they normally sell these large jar candles from Yankee uh, for. Now, uh, so burning, um, <sighs> scent appeal when burning is like an eight, it's beautiful. Now, the burn, as usual, and I'm sorry, I'm not trying to poo poo the whole, aluminum lid thing so I'm not trying to do that at all but what I'm trying to say is when you spend now my, mind you I got mine on sale at winners but if you go to get the sand surf which is in the regular collection for in Canada it's like 29 to 30 dollars right to get this jar normally in my personal opinion although aluminum lids are beautiful and an, an added decoration and I think that's beautiful you can get different ones for seasons I don't believe that one should have to purchase an aluminum lid to make your candles burn more flawless. That's just my own opinion. And um, I don't expect anyone else to follow that opinion or anything like that. I'm not looking for anyone to do so. But the reason why I say this is I have this issue every single time with Yankees. It still smells good. I still like this candle. This is one of the surprising ones that actually throws. Like I give it the throw itself I give in my bedroom because this is where it's been. I'd give it a seven. It's just the right amount. But again, the scent that it's supposed to describe, sand and surf, it's not supposed to be an overpowering smell at all. It's supposed to just be really mild, but it's beautiful. And I really like it. It's probably one of my favorite Yankee candles that I've burnt to date. This and pink sands are probably one of my tops. Reminisce. Back, let's go back a little bit with the burn. Going back to the burn, I always get this with Yankees. I'm actually right about here with the burn right now. Um, this all will drag down eventually with, with time, the stuff that, that's on the top. I'm not bothered by that at all. But when it comes to setting, it actually had sit on it from when I was burning it back last summer. So I would stopped burning it up to about here. It shouldn't be doing the sitting that soon or that high into the jar. I can sort of see it obviously just like Bath and Body Works candles. The, the further down you burn, the more likelihood that it's gonna sit. And I get that. But the whole Illuma lid thing is decorative, but they also advertise those to put on top of your candles to help with the burn. 
And you know what? And I'm seeing, I see tons of people who do reviews and they've got Illumo lids. And you know what? The, I'm certain that they do help the burn, but I refuse to pay a lot of money for a candle, you know, and then add to it and have to feel like I have to add to it to make it burn right. I don't do that Bath & Byworks candles or uh, a Loom or a Quise or any DW Home. I don't do that for any of those other ones. And I, and I have very like way less sooting than I do with these. Mind you, the jars are deeper and so on and so forth. But overall, I absolutely, absolutely recommend this candle to anyone who likes that beach scent, to want to reminisce from your childhood of a time when, and like innocence and playfulness and, you know, you don't, like with me, I think the last time I did that was when I went to Maui. I didn't have, I didn't think about anything. Two weeks away on a beach, sunscreen, hat, ocean, drinks. It was grand. Awesome. I highly recommend this candle to anybody who wants to feel that, who can't necessarily get to a beach. I really like this candle. I just preface by stating, you will probably, if you don't have an Illumilid, get a little bit of sitting along the top. But for a Yankee candle, I am pleasantly surprised and happy to share with you that I actually think this one did really well. We'll see how it does in the last half, but so far so good, you guys. So this is my review on um, Yankee Candles Sand and Surf, and I hope you're able to find it this year. And if I can find another one, I probably will pick it up. So you guys take care, and as always, be safe.